are day in the life of Nixie. This is Nixie. One day he chased a hot dog on a string down the road. He went for miles. Nixie went on for a few miles and then he reached the ocean. The hot dog continued to fly over the top of the ocean. Nixie swam after it through shark infested waters, risking his life for a hot dog. Nixie then reached Egypt after traveling for several miles. There was a pig pyramid, Osama bin Laden, and the hot dog on a string. He was on his knees. I'm found. Nixie went around the whole world. It took him a long time, but eventually he got where he was going. Nixie ended up outside a little girl's house. He reached with all his might, and he took a bite of the hot dog. Come in, said the little girl. He asked, who are you, young stranger? She said, my name is Caroline. Please come in. I'll give you more food. And so, Nixie decided to enter the house. Dum, dum, dum. Nixie went inside for more food. Five minutes later. Nixie got to know the girl that night. He knew that he'd recognized her from somewhere, but he didn't know where, and then it hit him. She was a pig. As Nixie's desperation continued, he wanted to do her. She placed the blindfold over him as they were naked, and they started to touch each other. Nixie decided he would go down on her. Still blindfolded, Nixie went down on Caroline. And in it went, and the cock pushed a lump to the back of his throat. Dun, dun, dun. Nixie jumped up and tore off the blindfold with a mouthful of cum. His hair was on end. He was petrified. All of Nixie's hair fell out as the evil pig laughed. Look at her. She's Ooh. evil. And Nixie oh, cried his eyes out as all his hair had fell out and he had become a fat little chaff. With no pants. The end. The end. When you were going, no. Hi. Yes. I am Gary, the narrator of this story. I am Nathan, the picture man of the story. This is Kane, the cameraman of the story.